Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and welcome back to WRC 7 where today it is day 1 in WRC 2 here at the Rally de Portugal. First up is a super special day, uh, super special stage to kick off the weekend. Just the two stages on day 1. Uh, so it should be a nice little sweet run, hopefully with no damage to this Ford Fiesta R5. So this super special stage, God, I can't English today for some reason. This super special stage is 60% tarmac and 40% gravel. So it's the first sort of super special stage where you're switching between surfaces. So in the WRC Junior category that we just ran, it was pretty interesting to say the least. Although we did get a win and not just a win, we managed to smash the field by 10 seconds. Which on a super special stage, although you do run two laps of each sort of... Uh, sort of inside and outside lane to get 10 seconds on the field is I'm pretty I was pretty shocked with that I must admit and then onto the special stage two which is actually quite easy unfortunately I did make a little bit of a mistake um, just trying to find the freaking windscreen wiper I couldn't find the windscreen wiper in WRCJ and sort of wasn't watching where I was going and ran off the side of the track came back on though with no real damage to the car and ended up third after day one but I'll let you guys go and check that out yourselves all right, so, Luis I don't know. I can't Portuguese. I cannot even, like, I've been to Portugal once, but the language I found is quite difficult for some reason. you sort of got to have the, uh, the accent, or else it doesn't sound right. All right, anyway, that's enough chit-chat. Let's start day one here in WRC2 for Rally Portugal. All right. And we're underway. Portion, right three, Titan. Narrows into junction, right four, tightens, break. Nice move, get that out of the screen. Into left three, long, don't cut, under bridge. Into left four, uphill, gravel, wide. Oh, understeer, 50. chronic understeer. Left three, oh god, 100. I can't even keep it out the fence. Portion, hard break, acute hairpin left. Don't cut, narrows, tarmac, 80. There we go, that's good. God, can't get this thing right to turn. Open. Oh, come on, my god. At right five, Titans four, narrows. Into right four, Titans three, long, don't cut. Into flat left, don't cut, gravel, and left four, Titans one. Having to use the handbrake everywhere just to get the thing to turn. Right oh. four, hard break. Into open hairpin right, don't cut, narrows, 80. Alright, well, we just have to lead over our opponent. Right three, Titans, narrows, into junction, right four, Titans, break. Left three, long, don't cut, under bridge. Into left four, uphill, gravel, widens, 50. Left three, 100. That was better. Oh, used too much handbrake that time to try to get it to turn. Hard break, acute hairpin left, don't cut, narrows, tarmac, 80. Got that handbrake right, right both three, times. Open. Gotta focus on the positives, I suppose. At right five, Titans four, narrows. Into right four, Titans oh, three, turn. long, don't cut. Into flat left, don't cut, gravel. And left four, Titans one, don't cut. Oh, that was close to that rock. Right four, hard break into open hair pit right, don't cut, narrows, 50, finished. Alright, well we must have had a much better second lap because I can't even see our opponent anymore. And across the line, alright, how did we go? Wow, smashed it again! Damn, we have really got this super special stage down. I can't believe that, I thought... That felt so slow, I could not get the thing to turn at all. I literally had like... 100 degrees lock on each corner just trying to get it to turn. The problem is... 
if you have understeer, the more you turn the wheel, the worse it makes it. You can see there, look. You can see the front tyres pointing almost outside of the guards. That was good though. Gain some times on the hairbreak turn. That's where we that's that, that's where we lost time in the WRC Junior category. Could not get the handbrake turns right in that car, but we've managed to get it right here in WRC two. Definitely could have gone way quicker though. See, just stabbing the handbrake, trying to get the thing to turn. So for those that are tuning in for the first time, uh, I do run this game at the max difficulty. I can't actually remember what it's called. I sort of just set it before the championship started and left it, but it is on the hardest difficulty. And I am seeing all these stages for the first time alongside you guys. I've seen this one, actually, well, I gotta lie, I've seen both stage one and stage two here on day one before, but in the junior WRC category, which is not really comparable because that car is ridiculously slow compared to this. So you're just trying to get it to turn. I'm not sure if I'd be better off just understeering my way through that corner than smashing the handbrake, but anyway. Fortunately, unlike other like rallies, we only get to run this super special state once. Which is a shame because if we if we had it tight, uh, if we had it on the itinerary twice, we probably could have built out an even bigger gap. But we'll see if we can hold on to it in stage two here in a sec. I mean, it definitely looks fast. Felt a lot slower on board. God, I almost died by hitting that rock there. But no, this Ford Fiesta R5 is definitely not handling well at all. I'm a bit worried going into the next stage as to what it's going to be like. No, he's struggled with the car quite a lot. I don't know how we managed a 10 second win, but Sunanen, Tiedemann, the two you expect to also be at the top. Mickelson down in 8th, Jankopetsky down in ninth. Alright, come on, let's just see if we can hold on to this lead. We weren't able to do it in WRCJ due to a mistake, but anyway. Alrighty, here we go. Stage two, final stage here on day one. Not too many stages this weekend. There's only five compared to the six that we've seen at the two previous rallies that we've been to, Corsica and of course Argentina. Now the stage didn't look too nasty in the WRCJ, but we are going a lot quicker now. Here we go. Final stage, day one. 13 flat left. Long, don't cut, a flat right, narrow into tunnel, a flat right, and caution, hard brake. Left two, narrow, long, 30, caution. Hard brake, square right, open, oh. 40. Wrong line. Oh, wrong line again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah. Right four, tighten, and left five, long, bump, 40. Left two, don't cut, into right five, over bump, 40. Left three, and right two, long, keep in, and 50, over bump. Come on, turn, far out. Left three, short, don't cut, over bump, 50, crest. Right three, keep in, long, don't cut, into left four, very long, tighten, over press. Left five, short, into right five, open, don't cut, 100. Flat left. Over press and left five and caution. Left three, don't cut and right three, open 30. Right three, don't cut 30. Left five, over press 30. Over press, left three, open 30. 
Uh, ten con uh, right nasty cliff face there. And left five, sixty. Left one, very long. Keep it. It's a right four. Long, tighten, thirty. Left four, short. It's a flat right. And right four, it's a right four. And flat left, it's a crest, fifty. And right three, forty. Square left, open. And right four, fifty. Left four, into left three, short. And press, and left five, short. Break, into right three, thirty. Flat left, thirty. No, ah, oh, shit, what the hell? Telegraph pole. Portion, break, square right, don't cut, 100. That's right, we didn't lose too much time. Although I doubt the side of our car Flat looks right. too pretty. Into left four, long, open, 70. Flat left, and right four, 40. Left five, short, into right five, don't cut, and flat left, tightens four, over crest, and left four, 30. Right five, 50, over crest. Portion, right three, tightens, don't cut, and left four into right four, tightens two, don't cut. Oh. Into left one, open, over press, 20. Come on, power. Left five into right four, 30, right five into finish. All right, and across the line. Not too shabby, but I don't think we lost too much time. Oh god, we did lose a lot of time. Ten seconds. Yeah, no, that wasn't as good as I was hoping for. Made one too many mistakes there. God damn, that's a whole lot of us. I didn't think it was that bad. Yeah, we lost a good three seconds, two seconds through there. The start of the stage is horrible. But we should still maybe just have the lead. I'm not quite sure who I saw it was in second and third there, but hopefully it wasn't Tiedemann or Sunanen. So I guess for the WRC category, it's just going to be about minimising mistakes. I don't think we're all that bad on this stage when we didn't... I mean, I went quite soft at times, didn't quite push as hard as I probably could have. What a stage though, it's not that difficult I must admit, especially when you're coming from El Condor in Argentina, nowhere, nowhere near as uh, difficult as that, that was just, I, I said it once, say it again, uh, it's that stage is honestly, it's like something out of Mario Kart, this was a definite breeze compared to that, definitely can't make a mistake though, as you can see some of these rocks on the edge of the track sort of, I call them cliff faces, they're not cliff faces, they're just, that's what I call them. <laughs> They're not easy, but you can't put a foot wrong because they will destroy your car. Here, I, I think it was here where I just got it all sorts of screwed up. Must admit, it is an awesome rally. I mean, the graphics in this game now are quite good, I'm not going to lie. Oh, nailed that sort of square right or square left. Alright, now here, I didn't realise this was a... I didn't realise that it was 
because when you look back at the stage, it, uh, when you look back a couple of corners before, it almost looks like it's like a nice sort of four run the whole way down the hill, but there's actually a sort of goes left and then a sharp right that I sort of saw out of nowhere. Anyway, that's why you got to listen more to your co-driver. Definitely didn't hold anything back at the end of this stage. I knew we would have lost so much time at the beginning and, and after that sort of telegraph pole hit. So I needed to gain something back here towards the end. Unfortunately made a mistake there. It's got to be cleaner, that's all there is to it. I don't think our pace is too bad, although this car is understeering way more than I want it to be. I mean, in a perfect world, you really want the rally car to be oversteering a bit, but... Uh, I don't know, and my problem is that my whole sort of career has all been on bitumen, so I've never really had any experience with dirt or anything like that. I mean, I know, I, well, I've had oval dirt experience with, like, sprint cars and stuff, but nothing on rally, so... Anyway, we still just have the lead over Synanen. Uh Tiedemann dropped back actually quite a bit, so he must have had an issue there on that stage, but Mickelson up to fourth now. Definitely can't hang about on day two, but that is it for day one. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Stay tuned for tomorrow's extra stage, or extra long stage as I like to call it. 10.6k is it's not that long for an extra long stage, but as you can see there, there is quite a lot of tight and twisty corners so it should be interesting 95% gravel which means there'll probably be like a little strip <laughs> that's on tarmac but that's about it all right guys stay tuned for wrc day one coming up here in a sec that should hopefully end up the same as what we've ended up here on day one in the lead can't believe it in the lead after day one that is awesome all right guys until next time i'll catch you later